G'day team, Coach Ray here. I'm a triathlon and marathon running coach who specializes in coaching beginner and recreational athletes to achieve their sporting as well as their health and fitness goals. In today's short video, I'm gonna show you how to load up a workout into Zwift. Let's just have a quick look in terms of where you'll find it. When you click on menu and the workouts at the top, you'll have a custom uh, workouts folder. And now I don't have any custom workouts. Oh, look at that. Custom workouts folder is there, but there's nothing in it. Anyway, let's get back out of that briefly, and I'm going to log out because I'll need to log back in once I've loaded it. Let's just exit out of that. Alrighty, so in terms of getting a Zwift file to load up, there's a number of ways of doing it. If you are part of my membership of quickkiwi.com, all your workouts within all the training plans come with a number of downloadable workout files. The .zwo is the Zwift file. And so easiest way to do it is just click on it and download it. Another way of getting workouts to do is go to my website, coachray.nz, scroll down uh, to select a category, and then select cycle workouts, and it will bring up all the different cycling workouts, all 26 pages of them. So there's plenty to choose from there. Anyway, so here's one here. I've just clicked on this one at random. All the details are there. If you do want a copy of it, just drop me an email at, dub, at coachray at coachray.nz and I'll send that uh, Zwift file through to you so you can use that. Happy to do that. Anyway, so we've downloaded our Zwift file and we just need to store it now in our folder. Now whether you're on Mac or Word, it's the same location. Go into your documents, you'll find a Zwift folder into Workouts, and then you'll have a unique number there, uh, which is nice and easy to identify, or not easy to identify, but it is uh, specific to you. So what we need to do is take the downloaded file, drop it in that folder, and let it upload and then we'll log into Zwift and this takes a little bit of time as we all know and I've got my speakers turned off so we don't get the lovely Zwift intro music so let's get into Zwift and load that file up now I'm not going to worry about connecting my bike Here it comes. Alrighty, so we're just going to watch initially. Get into Watopia. We'll see what's happening. We'll see what people are doing. Almost there. Alrighty, so if we go back to me and click on menu, and we can click on workouts. And here it is here, the custom workouts. The one we downloaded, the threshold intervals, three by eight minutes power. Click on that, comes up with the details. There's my current um, FTP in there for the world to see. And then we can just click on workout. And we can start writing. So you can see all the details are all loaded up there, ready to go. Once we start pedaling, we'll be into the workout. It is as simple as that, loading up your workout files from within the Quick Kiwi membership site or, and, or any other source and loading it in there and getting out for a ride on Zwift. Alrighty, all the best with your training. If you have any questions, feel free to add comments down below or drop me an email. Happy to send those Zwift files through.